Monica and friends in War Zone. Ah, look, it's raining. It's beautiful. I don't like the rain, of course. But I always get such a warm and safe feeling when it starts to rain and I'm here indoors. <laughs> Inside my house, there's nothing that can reach me. I can hop around here, over there, with no fear. And do you know what the best part is, huh, huh? Rainy day pastries, mmm. I'm not like Maggie, but I do love them so. <laughs> And my mom fries up delicious pastries whenever it's cold and it starts to rain. <laughs> Are you already frying those pastries I love so much, Mommy dear? Huh? <laughs> no, I'm running around like crazy to stop these annoying leaks. Oh, right. Oh, there's leaks. There's water leaks here in the house. No, that's not possible. Oh, no, not inside of my sacred temple of safety. Warmth and love. Oh, oh really? I'll have you know that the one who ruined this temple was you, young man. Me? B -b 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 how, Mom? How, Mom? By kicking the ball onto the roof. You knocked many tiles off the roof. Oh, well, then I'll let you take care of all of your chores that you need to do, and I won't get in your way at all, okay? Oh, how did you even do that? You can take these pots and plastic buckets and place them all around the house. Oh, jeez, and there goes my happiness right down the whole train, just like, like, uh, huh? Whoa. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Uh oh. Uh, 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 that was way too close. Oh, if I hadn't dodged it, it would have been goodbye smudge. Wow, oh, and what now? How am I supposed to go anywhere near that flood? Ooh, ooh, uh, I know. Why don't I call the firefighters? Bobble, 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 bobble. It's an emergency. Out of the way. Woo wee, woo wee, woo wee, woo wee. Courage, guts, strength, and heart. Go, little firefighters. Oh, you're almost there. Aha, there you go. Am I a hero or what? <laughs> I'm ready for my medal. Any pictures? Smudge! Huh? What are you doing just standing there, huh? The water is starting to get in here from under the door. Ah, invasion! The enemies are coming in! Ah, ah. Faithful warriors, don't let the invaders inside! We must contain their advances! Aha! You can't handle this, you ugly evil monsters! Splash! 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 You shouldn't have messed with me, the king of the castle. Cloppity, 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 cloppity. Ah! Who left the window open? Oh! Choo, 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 Wing, wing, wing. Oh! Wing, 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 wing. Wing, 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 wing. Uh oh, uh oh. End of the line. Now's the moment you've been training for. Wait for the perfect moment, too. Choo, 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 choo. And clap. Activate the energy field. Wow, 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 wow. Woo, 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 woo. Surprise! <laughs> and now it's time for the best part. <laughs> Woohoo! Woohoo! 
Jeez, now what? Uh oh. 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 It's the end. Oh. Help me, please. Oh, Smudge, are you okay? Mommy, take me out of here, please. Oh. Oh, oh my oh, honey, oh, what oh, happened? Water. There's water all over the house. We're surrounded. There's nowhere for us to escape. Oh, you uh -oh. poor thing. I never thought that you would be so scared. Why don't we do this? I'll give you a few more umbrellas. And you stay right there safely. And your mommy will take care of all the lakes, OK? Uh. <laughs> Only my mommy could make me feel so safe and sound. With all of that heavy rain pouring outside and, huh? Oh. Uh. Uh. Yeah, what she said, no. Oh. No. Uh. Believe me, little buddy, it's so much safer in here. Back in there, it's like a real uh, life war zone. Uh, <laughs> oh no! The time has come to read my comic books while eating honey cookies on the couch. <laughs> oh, I love, love, love this moment. It's so good. I think that any time I get to eat anything on the living room couch is absolute heaven. <laughs> Especially when it's our couch in our house. It's so massive, so soft, and... <gasps> hmm? What is that awful smell? Hmm? It's not the smell of spoiled cookies, nor moldy comic books. Huh? Hmm? Huh? Could it be from the pillow? <laughs> My goodness, what is that stench? Is there a dead skunk living underneath my house now? It almost smells like. Hmm. It smells like cat pee! Vanilla, come back here. I know that it was you. It's not my fault. I'm innocent. I'm innocent. <sighs> Did you go pee pee on my pillow or not? Let me think. I tried to get to the sandbox, but the door of the fridge was blocking my way because there was a glitch in eating in front of it. Mmm, huh? mm, yum. You have a whole sandbox to go in. Why didn't you use it? I just meowed you. Why, silly? And when we are desperate to go, even a pillow will do. Yuck, 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 yuck. Oh. Yuck, he's having to walk over the crumbs of that pudding you ate last week. Thank goodness it's dry, at least. Now, doesn't she know that pee can dry too? What are they teaching her at that school? It's a good thing I know what to do. <laughs> a little spray of perfume will solve any smelly problem. Aha! Mr. Katzer, if you were trying to ruin my reading time, you didn't do it. Because this head that you see here knows how to think. <laughs> really? I thought that all it did was hold your mouth. Meow. Ah, and now it's back to the good life. And with the soft scent of lavender in the air and... Huh? Hmm? Huh? You shouldn't do that. Yuck! Ah! It got worse! Now it smells like cat pee pee mixed with perfume! There are worse things, you know. Have you ever eaten a flower? Ew, it smells gross. Ugh, I can't even catch a breath. Ooh. If she knew what I have to deal with under the bed sheets. I think that brushing it with some soap will solve it. Now, I will dry it real well and voila! A brand new sweet smelling pillow. 
One that does not smell like cat pee. I hate pirates. Ah, this pillow smells so good. Now I can take in a really deep breath. Yes, Maggie, breathe it all in. Ah! What is with your pee on this horrible smell that never goes away? Cats are powerful. Well, I'm going to take care of this once and for all. I'll put this in and a dash of this for some of this. We'll see. Huh? And now to finish it, I'll dry it out in the sun. Meow. I knew it. Everything ends in a warm, comforting sun. Why, you, 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 you? Oof. That's not comforting at all. Ah, finally. My pillow is so nice and soft, clean, and pleasantly fragrant for me to. Uh. If you know mm -hmm. what happens next, raise your hand. Ah! Oh, no, no. <laughs> Girls, they're so emotional. Get off! Off, 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 get it off, I don't know what's worse, the smell or this breakdown. Off, 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 What is happening, Maggie? Did you run out of your favorite green plums in your fridge again? Because over at Mr. Smith's shop, I just saw that there's a... No! This has nothing to do with plums. It's this pillow the vanilla peed on, and now it has been ruined! Meow, I didn't ruin it. It already had mayo stains and cookie crumbs all over it. Meow. There is just no way of getting this awful smell to come out. Oh, calm down, my friend. I'm pretty sure that I know what to do. I'll go grab a few things to help you and be right back. Huh? But, 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 but do you think it's going to work, Monica? Trust me on this, Maggie. Mm -hmm. This will work almost as good as a magic trick. First, we add the washing soap, then some dish soap, lemon, vinegar, and a dash of some salt. And a couple drops of air freshener to make it right. The stink of cat pee is completely gone. Uh, how did you do that anyway? Oh, I have a lot of experience, my friend. All you need is to have a dog by the name of Ditto. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that Monica. Well, at least I don't have that problem because everyone knows that kitties are more well-behaved than dogs and... <gasps> oh, vanilla, what do you think that you're doing on top of my pillow? I'm peeing again. Duh, there was a tiny bit of smell left. And you know how that is. I felt like it. Meow. You, 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 you. Maggie? Yes? Explain something to me. Why is Vanilla wearing a diaper? Oh, you don't want to know, Mom. You don't even want to know. Yeah. Skating on wax. Mm -hmm. And now I'm 
want you to stay right there until I'm finished, all right? Uh, do you happen to have any fresh toast to eat with this honey? And here we go again. Oh, all done. And now all I have to do is stop anyone else from staying in it. I'll catch you, Sponge. <laughs> oh, someone come back here. here. Oh. Come back here. Whoa. You are. Whoa, 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 Sponge's fault. He cheated on our swap the cards no, game. No, I did not cheat on any such thing at all, sir. Really? Uh, then why is that wet of gum on your hand, huh? Oh, I was holding on to it to put it under my pillow later. I'm not interested in what happened. You two go to the couch. Huh? What for? Because I just told you to. Hey there, Maggie. How are you? That depends. Do you have any toast with you? Huh? Here comes more mice now. It looks like a mirror. Oh, thank God. I was getting tired of all that waiting, honestly. Oh, there's no more honey. No need for tears, my friends. You can all get off the couch if you want to, but be careful not to get the floor all dirty again, right? Whoa, it was about time, too. I'm going down. Whoa, 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 whoa. The floor is so slippery. Whoa, whoa. Oh, it is. I just can't catch my bearing. Whoa, 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 whoa. You just get out from under me. And I want you to get off of me, both of you. Oh. I know that I just waxed the floor really well, but I didn't use that much wax. I don't understand why everybody says that. <laughs> oh, now I understand why your floors become so slippery. You just waxed your whole house using cooking oil. Oh, I don't believe it. And now what? How are we going to move around? Here we go. Now here's what we're going to do. We have to try to get that door. Everybody, let's go. Everyone take a hold of each other's hand. And now everybody stand up. Everybody ready? I'm ready to fall back down, that's for sure. Chewed gum. inside of their house. I don't know. Maybe they're all part of a collection. Stop your jibber-jabber and keep moving forward. Go! This time we're going to make it. <sighs> Almost there. We did it. Yeah. Freedom. We're free now. Let's <laughs> <laughs> make the wee freedom. I couldn't take it anymore. Me neither. <laughs> we should all celebrate. Yes, we should. Yeah. Oh, what did you have in mind? <laughs> I don't know. Anything we want to. <laughs> oh no, doing anything is so boring. Yep, I agree with that too. 
Well, then what are we doing? Mm, I think I have something. Yeah! yeah. Explain it. <laughs> huh? Huh? Hooray! I just killed everybody! Except that round didn't count! Everybody already knew that you were chosen as the killer. Hey! Who told everyone that? Uh... Everyone needs to pick a new card again. card here represents? Huh? Oh, you idiot! That means you're the detective! What's that mean? That means that you have to figure out who the killer is and say who it is out loud! Oh! <laughs> it's Monica! It's Monica! I figured it out! <laughs> I figured it out! No, you did not! I winked at you first! No, you didn't! You're a murderer! I did! I did! Hey, this mm -hmm. round doesn't count either. Let's play another round. All right, come and pick your cards again. Mm -hmm. I'm the detective? Nick Jimmy Five, the greatest detective in the world, prepares to solve another terrible murder case. With a single clue, he looks the suspects in the eyes and... And then... Mm -hmm. No way, that's not fair! Shh, be cool, bro! You're gonna pay for this, you, you villain! Ugh. Hmm. Da -da 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 -da. Hey, do you wanna do me a favor and look this way? Huh? Not 
Look here! Look here! Look here! Oh, wait. Since you won't let me kill you guys, then I'll just go kill something else. My hunger. Hey, you can't just abandon the game. That's not fair. It's because you didn't give me a chance. Give me the cards. I hope this time we can find a way to play correctly. Oh. I'm the new killer. Hey, why is nobody looking at me? Huh? I win the game! I win the game! But what you just did was against the rules. Oh, here we go again. <sighs> oh, I'm the killer. I'm the killer. <laughs> no one will ever find out. I'm the killer. <laughs> This is amazing. <laughs> Oops. I can't let them suspect that it's me. <laughs> What's that all about, Jimmy Five? Shh. I winked at you because I'm the killer. Oh, right. I'm dead. Please excuse me while I go grab some more food to eat. Look there! It's a flying cow on the ceiling! Huh? Where is it, Jimmy Five? I didn't see anything! I'm dead! Since I am the detective, I think I know who the killer is. After long hours of research, assumptions and hypotheses... Hey! Look back over here! I have come to conclusion that the killer is none other than Jimmy Five. Huh? No, you can't. Oh, but I just did it, baby. That doesn't count. You just cheated. Huh? I did not cheat. What? Now the killer's become a cheater? You're a cheater, a deceiver, and a trickster. La 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 la. Monica's not a good loser. Oh yeah. I'm about to show you who's really good at losing his teeth! Oh. 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 Wowzer, just what kind of game were you all playing in here? A new kind of game. We just made it up right now. It's called How oh. to Be the Victim. Right. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. The Haunted Washing Machine. How many times have I told you that young children are not supposed to watch these horror movies? What are you saying about a horror movie? We're not, Mom. We're only watching the news and the weather forecast. Forecast? And why this much scream so loud? Because they said it was gonna rain for the whole week, and it will get worse. Ah, it's the end of time! It's the apocalypse! The world will be consumed by water! Ah! Calm down, Smudge. The rain is outside. There's no way it can get you wet in here. Yes, it can. Did you forget that the house has leaks all over? Ah! Jimmy, fuck! How can you be so cruel, son? <laughs> That's enough, you two. Everyone go straight to bed. But, Mom, it's still so early. No, it's not. And I don't want to hear a peep anymore. See what you've done now? Me? You were the one that was making fun of me out there. Ah, because you are way too sensitive. Hey, you know what? I am. So, just the thought of water, oh, it gives me such a chill, and then I start to tremble. All right, all right. Oh. I have to let me sleep, because we have to wake up early tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> hmm? oh. Oh. Hey, what is it now, Smudge? Uh, I'm thirsty. Well. Go and get yourself a glass of water then, man. No, I'm too afraid to get close to the faucet. I can't believe it. That's a new one. Listen, Jimmy Five, my great adventure buddy, my faithful companion, my beloved brother, could you please bring me a glass of water? Huh? 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 I better get going. Otherwise, you won't let me sleep at all tonight. But be very careful with all the leaks around the house, okay? 
My goodness. Next time I'm gonna invite Sonny to sleep over. Oh, are you still awake this late, my son? Yeah, I have to get smudge a glass of water. What about you? I'm just finishing up the laundry and then I'll go straight to sleep. Ah, that's cool. Then good night to you too, Mom. Good night, son. Smudge, uh... here's your water. Wow, thank you so much. You're the bestest friend, man. Oh, wait a second. Where's the straw to drink from? Huh? Oh, do you really think that I would dare put my dry mouth anywhere near this wet glass? Oh, God, calm down, my man, or you might end up spilling the water on me and... Oh, you know what? I'll go get the straw myself. <laughs> wow, it's so dark in here. I didn't know that Jimmy Five lived in a house that was so frightening. Uh -huh. I hope I don't come across any of the leaks. <laughs> hey, wait a sec. What's that strange noise? I think it's coming from inside the laundry room. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> all right, can you explain to me very calmly what all this fuss is about? Your mother's washing machine, it's, 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 it's haunted. It, it, it even tried to get me wet. So then I cried, and then I stopped because I know that tears are made of water, and you know I don't want Will that. Will you please stop squinting? What are you talking about? What haunted washing machine? I'm trying to tell you that it's haunted. Just go look. I bet you there's a ghost inside of it, man. Oh, oh now you're just being silly, Smudge. Why would a ghost want to be inside my mother's washing machine? Well, taking a bath, of course. After all, ghosts are made out of bed sheets. Oh, my dear lord of video games and computers. Give me patience, please. Oh, look at it there. Well, it looked way scarier when I was in here earlier. Hmm? Maybe I was just hallucinating. <laughs> hey, do you hear that noise now? It sounds like a change that ghosts wear. <laughs> Stop acting like that. Look at that! Look at that! And I was attacking us with water! I told you so! I told you so! Whoa, that was way too close. Just another second and it would have drowned me. Don't exaggerate, Smudge. Stop it! It's just that the machine has a tiny little leak. We just need to close the little door here and... Ooh, Jimmy Five. Hey, buddy. Talk to me, man. Are you all right? Oh. Ah, he turned into a zombie! Ah, call an exorcist! <laughs> you are so silly, you baby! I was only trying to mess around with you! <laughs> oh, Jimmy Five? Is that really you? Of course! I already told you, there's no such oh. thing as a haunted washing machine! Then you better tell that haunted machine, hmm? because it's getting closer oh. to you! Oh. 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 What are we gonna do? I know, I'm gonna find some holy water. Holy water? That won't work. Huh? Think the haunted machine has enough water inside already. Then what are we gonna do with it? Oh, let me try to think. What can defeat the supernatural? Hang in there. Jimmy Five! Ah! Huh? What's with all that stuff? What's going on out there? Oh, I got it, Smudge. I got it. <laughs> Quick, give me the garlic. Oh, the cloth didn't work. Uh, <laughs> oh, stop. Uh, oh, this. No, no, no. Jimmy Five! Whoa. I'm sorry, Mom, <laughs> but the washing machine has been possessed. It's nothing like that, you two. It's probably just stuck mid-cycle again. All you have to do is restart it. Here, look. There it goes. All back to normal. Did you see? Oh. <laughs> what about the ghostly chain noises? Oh, oh you two sillies. Oh. That's because I'm washing some pants that have some chains on them. Just huh? take a look. Huh? This washing machine is always giving me trouble. I'm going to call a technician to come and fix it tomorrow. Huh? Uh, so does that mean the machine's not haunted then? Haunted machine? <laughs> That's impossible. I knew it wasn't all along. No, you didn't. You were the one huh? who suggested we use the garlic. Uh, but, but it's... Let's go back to bed, you uh. boys. Everything is fine. All right, all right. Phew! Thank goodness the boys finally left. It seems like a ghost can't even take a quiet bath anymore. Lost in the bedroom. Let's prepare 
to set sail. Let's go full speed ahead. <laughs> and here we go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, Smudge, what a great idea that was to build these toy mountains in your womb. It's awesome. Ah, it was awesome, wasn't it? I built these things little by little, getting some junk over here and some from over there. It took me a whole week to finish it, but it was worth it. Yes, it was. And with all of these great toys that I've collected, we can imagine any kind of adventure that we could possibly want. <laughs> Let's pretend that we're all soldiers from outer space, okay? Oh, no! It's getting late already. I have to go home and take a shower, but I will come back tomorrow and keep on playing, okay? Take a shower? That is the worst excuse that I've ever heard. If you had said that it was time for your soap opera, I would have understood it more, but... Uh, but Smudge... What's up? I can't seem to find where your bedroom door is. What do you mean? The door is right there next to the bed. Hey, where's my bed at? I was pretty sure it was to the left of the wardrobe and... Speaking of which, where did the wardrobe go? And we can't even get out through the window because I don't know where it is. Hey, Smudge, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. We are trapped in here, lost inside your bedroom. <laughs> That's it. I'm gonna be trapped inside here forever in this smelly place that smells like wadding feet. <sighs> I can't catch my breath anymore. <sighs> Relax, Jimmy Five. I'm gonna find a way to get us out of here. Yeah, Willy? But how? Easy. I'll just use a compass to find the door. Use a compass? That's great! I didn't know that you even had a compass on you. I found it in the garage with some other junk that my dad was throwing out that day. How cool! Tell me, where is it pointing to? To the mountain over there! Now how are we gonna get through there? I have an idea. Hope is here. Here it is. We have a flashlight and a helmet for each one of us. I think that we're under your bed now. I hope that we can find the way out of here before we run into something like dirty socks. I found it! The way out or a pair of dirty socks? Neither one of those things. I just found my favorite trading cards, Cow Blau Blau. Oh, what a happy day. Let's play Ring Around the Rosy, and we'll sing and have fun all night long. Smudge, focus, focus. We're looking for the way out, remember? All of these bottle caps, marbles, and card collections won't do us any good if we die of hunger in here. Enough! I threw all of it over the junk mountain. Maybe this way we won't get so distracted by all of this garbage. Okay, now you should check the compass to see if we're headed in the right direction. I'm very sorry, but I can't do it. But why not? Because you just got rid of the compass along with the rest of my garbage, remember? Huh? Oh, it's the end! We're all doomed inside here! Calm down. There's no need to give up hope just yet. It's easy to find the way out. Take a look. There's a light over there. I bet you that it's from the bedroom window what? and... Ah! We're saved! Uh, hey, Smudge. I think the light you saw was not from the bedroom window. No? What do you mean? It's sunny! What are you doing in here, my man? And what's up with the beard? What in the world happened to you? Huh? What in the world happened to me? <laughs> uh, three days ago, I came in here to pick up my ball that accidentally got in through the window. But it's so messy in here that there was no way for me to find the way out. Three days now? My goodness, and nobody's even noticed that he was missing. That's so awful. Hey, Sonny. Uh, we're here to rescue you. Why don't you get up? Yeah, I think that we're pretty close to the exit. The exit? There's no way out of here. It's an endless labyrinth made out of cardboard boxes, comic books, and plastic bottles, and useless broken toys. Only my dear Will says for real. <laughs> the rest of it is all lies. Don't believe anything. It's all a web of lies. All a web of lies. Oh, <laughs> uh, we gotta get out of here, Jimmy Five. We can always come back here to rescue Sonny later. He's completely lost his mind. But we can't leave him here like this. He must be starving by now and... Aha! Well, the problem is solved. Here it is. A whole box of meat pies that I had left in here in my bedroom. Box of meat pies? I love these. Give them to me. I'm starving. Mm. I thought that they were going to be for Sonny. For who? Oh, yeah. For Sonny. Mm. I'll take whatever's left over to him. <laughs> I only hope that they're still good. What? What do you mean, still good? <laughs> That's because those are the leftovers from the birthday party that Monica had last year. Ah, you poisoned your own friend! 
What? No, wait a second! If I end up dying because of this, I'll come back here to pull on your feet! Help me, please! You know what? I'll practice it right now! Huh? Jimmy Five, you have to take a look at this! Take a look! We're back at the top of the mountain! What? Hey, isn't that the bedroom door over there? We finally found the exit! Yeah! Wait a second. That's not the bedroom door. What could that be? What if it's an ancient sacred temple that's been hidden in here for a very long time? Now what? Should we open it? But what if we provoke the wrath of some ancient god with a shellfish head? Well, as someone who's faced Monica, an ancient god with a shellfish head is a piece of cake. So true. I love finding danger. And one, and two, and three. Ah! One! We'll try to climb the mountains! No! Run away from the mountains! What was that thing? Oh, another of my projects. I built that big ball with all the gum that I've chewed over the past few years, and it was hidden away on the very top shelf inside of the wardrobe. Ugh, that's disgusting. I was just hit by a giant ball of chewed up bubble gum. We got lucky, actually. We could have been hit by an even bigger ball made of all of my boogers. Ugh. Hey, wait a second. Look at this bucket and at that broom. Oh, I think that I recognize this place, too. We're right back to the point where we started. Everything that we just did was for nothing. <laughs> We're trapped inside of here forever. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to miss my soap opera. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you crying in there? Are you boys okay? Ah! Look! It's the way out! Finally! We are free! Oh, what just happened? Mommy! Were you lost inside of my bedroom too? I'm so glad that I found you. Hey, are you really taking all the credit by yourself? Like I didn't help you out? Hold on a second, boys. Explain to me what was going in there. I... Oh, look, the sunlight. It burns me with all its glory. I feel so liberated and intoxicated at the same time. Oh, King Star, why did you abandon me in the darkness for such a long time? <laughs> what was he talking about? It's nighttime already. There's no sun out here. Yep, he's lost his mind. Well, I must get going. I don't want to miss dinner. The adventure in your bedroom was very fun. Did you say fun? <laughs> yeah, I must admit that it really was. But I'll say that I want to stay away from that room for a good long while. Mm, can you explain to me what that mess in your room is about, <laughs> young man? <laughs> Well, forget about what I said. It looks like I'm going to be stuck in here for a good long while instead. <sighs> Playing with dolls. In our previous episode, after an epic battle against his arch nemesis, the Dark Finn, all seemed lost for our hero. But he reappears triumphantly for another Captain Waste Adventure! That's just a silly boys show. Good morning, Mrs. Josephine. Good morning, Mrs. Candace. What's new with you today? There's some really cheap broccoli at the grocery store. Really? I have a lot of news for you today, too. Well, uh, oh, there is some really cheap broccoli at the grocery store today. Say, I just told you about that a second ago. But what else? Um, it's warm out, huh? Aw, yay, yay, yay. Oh, jeez, it's hard to play all by myself. Well, no, Monica's traveling. Then I'll just go to the park and... Huh? Calm down, I'm coming now. Huh? Close that door quickly. Oh. Why, Smudge? Oh, phew. You just saved my life, Maggie. Oh, that coming storm almost caught me by surprise. Almost. Don't be so silly. It's totally sunny outside. No, the humidity. I'm allergic to it. Oh. Ah, there's no need for you to worry about me. As long as the roof isn't leaking in here, it's okay. It's That's okay. That's not it. I was just about to go outside so that I wouldn't have to play alone in here. Oh, well, thank you for your lack of concern. Would you play inside with me, then? Of course. Why don't we play a game of arm wrestling? That's a boy's game. No way. I wanted to play with my dolls. Wow. 
but that's what girls play with. I understand. Huh? Bye then, Smudge. Oh, what? Why now? Are you trying to dismiss my great presence? Huh? Because boys can't play with dolls, oh, remember? Oh, Maggie, wait. You're offending my great imagination. Yeah, I can create a million stories. Oh, really? I can create unbelievable places. I can tell you about the most amazing adventures. Then you are going to be Mrs. Candace. Ah. <laughs> you just have to play all the coochie coochie. Smudge? Where do you think you're going off to? Coochie coochie? Uh, I prefer the rain. All right. Don't come back begging to stay later. What? You can sit here and wait then, okay? <laughs> Hand over Miss Candace then. <laughs> How are you, Mrs. Candace? What uh... news do you have for me? Let me think. Did you say news for you? Let's see. Oh, I'm having issues with the roof leak in my house that... Whoa! So as I was telling you, that gold tied the match and brought the team off the relegation zone. And then they were ready to score the goal. Talk to me, please. Oh. Hey, what did you expect from me? What if my friend saw me here playing dolls with a girl? I don't care. That was very rude of you. Does that mean I no longer have to play with your dolls? Oh, yes. You bet you do. Oh, boy. You know, Mrs. Candace, I have such a busy schedule today. I have to go shopping, then I'll go to the coffee shop, and then to a charity banquet benefiting broken dolls, and finally to my charitable auntie's dinner. What about you? Well, first off, I'll go to the junkyard and try to find some empty cans to fix my gravity racer, then I'll go pick up the latest generation video game at Predator X's house. Who is this Predator X? That's her boyfriend's name, duh. No, Mrs. Candace would never date anybody by the name of Predator X, much less would she ever drive a cavity racer. Gravity. And I don't care what you say. Mrs. Candace is a lady, you hear? Lady. And that's why they'll both go to a tea shop without you. Chooky, 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 too. That's the noise that a doll makes when she's walking. Uh, why do I even ask? Chucky, 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 too. Chucky, 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 too. Bleh. We're here. Mr. Waiter. Yes, Mrs. Josephine? I'll have the usual. A hot mint tea and five slices of lemon pie. You make your cat waiter? Of course. He always plays with me when I play with my dolls. Here's your tea, ladies. Have your tea, Mrs. Candace. It's so delicious. Yes, Mrs. Whatever. Let us both drink this wonderful tea. Mrs. Candace and Mrs. Whoever are having their tea peacefully, not knowing that both of them hide some terrible secrets. Mrs. Whoever her name is, is actually the arch nemesis Atomic Stingray, with plans to conquer the world. Atomic Stingray has no idea that under that fashionable green satin dress is Waste Woman. Waste Woman drinks a cybernetic tea that gives her strength and powers. Oh, who's that? It's the Atomic Stingray. It's the Waste Woman. Waste Woman uses her stratospheric whistle and calls for her fighting partner. The Scarlet Felix. Go get her, Felix. Pow, boom, pow. That's cool, right? No. No, I don't like playing dolls with you, not even a little bit. But you're gonna like it now, because Captain Waste will come to save our, uh, uh, Mrs. Candace. It's even possible that they have a beautiful romance. That sounds horrible. Now you're not invited to the wedding. I'd rather just keep playing by myself. I think that it's safe for you to leave now. The rain's already stopped. Okay, you stay there by yourself then. I don't care, because Judy is calling. Bye. Idiot. Well then, where were we, Mrs. Candace? Oh, yes, we were having tea. Mmm, it's so delicious, right? By the way, did you know the local grocery store has super cheap broccoli? And, uh, uh. And then, Mrs. Stingray tries to hide in her lab deep in the depths of the ocean. But it won't be easy. Here comes Mrs. Waste with her loyal pet at her side, Scarlet Felix. Mrs. Stingray attacks the feline, which runs out through the window. And then Mrs. Stingray laughs victorious. 
Worry not, helpless feline. Your struggles will not go unavenged. By me, Captain Waste. <laughs>